Hello everyone, this is me Seth again. Um, today <laughs> I'm going to show you live again. You know, I just love this piece of software. Uh, in the last tutorials I made, someone said he has problems understanding me. You know, this is because I've got this lack of pronunciation because I am a German, you know. But I'm trying very hard to get the best, you know, uh, but let's get to work, okay? I've got this impulse here inside Ableton again, uh, Ableton already, and I've got this very basic beat here. You know, nothing uh, very special here, but now I want to add the audio effect track here and audio effect track here sorry and maybe mm, let's say I want to have a beat repeat here I select the all of the buttons here so I have the full control uh, on this effect track I adjust this um, a beat repeat here so let's say gate is one bar, uh, the interval is one fourth. Yeah. Um, let's say I add an auto filter here, just a low pass with an uh, LFO. No. It's synced and it is. Um, by now I'm adding just a few chains to this one by dropping a few uh, items here in the chain list. So I have this dynamic tube here and let me just enter some new effects here. So I'm back for now. Um, as you can see here I have added four chains here which are uh, which sound like this. Chain two. Chain two is this dynamic tube, and chain one you've already heard. Now I'm coming to the deal. Activate this chain here, um, and I'm going to adjust each chain to some special part of the um, controller assignment. Let me just put these few items here where they should be. I have four things here. I have a small program which is called MIDI Mouse. It is for, you know, I have my mouse, X and Y, and, you know, just for um, MIDI input, when I'm sitting in the train or flying, I'm going back to live, enter uh, the MIDI map, select this chain selector here, go back to MIDI mouse, MIDI mouse is here, you know, I'm just going through the X curve here. And as you see, MIDI has assigned controller change 12 to the chain selector. I'm exiting, oops, I'm exiting the MIDI uh, mapping right now. Switch back to MIDI mouse. And now when I'm when I start playing, you see that I'm that I can uh, access these chains through uh, the MIDI mouse here. Oops. Have 
fun with this small tip. See ya. Oh, wait a minute. Um, like Steve, I've got one more thing today. Sorry, I forgot this totally. Um, if you got an internet connection, and I hope you have, as you're seeing this uh, video, please have a look at www.metasinus.com slash radio. It is a um, web radio which is playing uh, net label music just tight worldwide. We are on air 24-7. I hope you like our music. So www.metasinus.com slash radio. Have a good day. Night. See ya.